This time I'm actually going to do the smart thing and pretty much just record basically everything all in one go because let's face it, that five minute clip that I tacked on into uh, part uh, 10? Yeah, um, I legitimately did not know that there were only five minutes left in that whole thing, so let's go! It's investigation time! As we enter part 12, right in code law offices, episode V. Whew, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Nick. Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess that really depends on the people we found out about in today's trial. The director and producer? Yeah, them. Well, what are we doing here then? Let's get to the studios. Uh, what to do? What to do? What do you think we should do? What do I... Huh? What do you... Why don't we do what you just said? We gotta get the scoop on this director and producer. Oh, right. Then there's no point in hanging out here. That's what I've been saying! Let's get to those studios pronto! Any ideas, then? Hmm... We don't have enough information to make a case yet. That's exactly the same thing you said yesterday. Just admit it, you don't have a clue what happened. There's not enough information. To be fair, yes. To be fair, yeah, there is definitely... Uh, is it just literally... Is this is this whole thing literally going to be, you know, the same thing? Because, you know... I literally have the... Have the audacity... To examine absolutely everything... Known to man, and there's nothing here. Okay. All right. Let's uh, get to it then. Studio Gates. Let's do it. 216 Global Studios, the main gate. No one's here. Right. Now now that they have Miss Olbag in, in custody. Oh, do they? Okay. So I guess they don't have anyone to replace her. Hey, in the guard station, look. She left her donuts. They're stale. They're stale. What? I wasn't going to eat them. I mean, to be fair, they were stale. So, let's see. The main gate. The main entrance to the studios. They probably have a police officer on patrol there. Okay. Overhead map of the studios. Right from here. What about in here? The computer that runs is the studio. Get the cameras. Huh? It looks like it's been turned off for the day. Okay. What about the van then? Looks like a studio van, probably using the road for the good. Okay, okay. La, 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 la. The security guard station. Miss Old Bag must like junk food. There's a mountain of there's a mountain of it on the desk in there. Okay, sure. Uh do we head to a studio yeah. Studio one then. Hey Nick. It looks like Detective Gumshoe is in here today. You're right. He's probably up to his neck in paperwork after the commotion at today's trial. So, Nick, remember that Studio 2 that we heard about the trial today? It was down that path with the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are there today? Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. Let us indeed, unless there's anything else to do. This is exactly why I don't want to get old, ever. Hey, I'm still young. I'm just tired. Nick, when you start having to say, I'm still young, you know it's all over. B but I am still young. Technically, well, to be fair on Nick's side, he is like 24 years old. It says welcome. They let people in here when they're not filming, right? Nick, let's come here someday. What do you say? Sure, if that security lady lets us in. I mean... You know, the one in custody and technically accused of murder. That's the security camera that takes place. It took two pictures on the day of the murder before the actual time of death. One of them was the Steel Samurai and the other one was a great school boy. It doesn't seem to be switched on today. Oh, someone is going to get in gigantic trouble, dude. Why don't they put his head back on? Maybe we should ask that assistant? I'm not really sure we 
we really want her fixing anything. And you probably need a crane to move that thing. Probably so. Yeah, probably. Uh, yeah. The entrance to Studio One. This is where they found Jackhammer's body. Yes. Okay. Sure. Uh, is there anything in Studio One, though? I don't really want to be in here. Yeah, it is a murder scene. I want to go someplace else. Nick? Eh, yeah, I guess you're right. There's no one here to talk to anyway. And here we go. This is Studio 2? I thought so. It doesn't really look like much of a studio, does it? No, that does not. That it does not. Hey, there's a trailer over there. Looks pretty sturdy for a movie set trailer. Are we sure this is a studio? Maybe. Uh, let's see what we got here. A light van for moving staff and equipment around. They kept it in pretty good shape. It looks like it run fine. Well, let's go for a drive. Sure, if I had a license. Nick, you don't have a driver's license? But look, I have this. Why are you showing me your attorney's badge, Nick? Because the attorney's badge is clearly a driver's license. Clearly. An incinerator. Apparently, they put... They just put this one in. It's already covered in soot. They must not clean it much. What about this? Looks like two people ate here. There's nothing left on the plates. Hey, so they ate T-bone steaks too. What is it with steaks around here? Hey, there's always room for steak. Again, you have really good tastes. But something does seem out of place. What? I... Don't know. It just feels odd. Yeah, it feels really odd that they would have steaks and not share it with any of you. Uh, anything? Oh, <laughs> wow! My my thing, my the um, the magnifying glass got stuck in the one, and I thought the game crashed for like a second. And I'm like, oh god, please don't tell me this. Don't tell me Capcom didn't like patch that out. And I'm like, uh, but then you know the UI apparently. Makes for blocking material. These look like materials for making a movie set. They've been sitting here for quite some time. This might as well be a junkyard. It might as well be. On closer expansion and inspection, this trailer looks like it's been here for a while. I don't think this is part of some temporary film set. And I just examined that. What about the garden? There are some flowers here. Wow, so pretty. They're taking good care of these. Don't get too close. The fence looks dangerous. Yeah, because, you know, the pointy fence without any sort of invisible security thingies clearly looks dangerous. I mean, actually, you're right. The fence is dangerous because look at the things on the bottom right. They're pointy. Nick, let's go inside. You think that's okay? Oh, well, it's locked. Aw, shucks. Shuck a luck a ding dong. Ugh. Well, we can't really go anywhere. I've already examined everything. So yeah, it looks like we gotta move again. Uh yeah, there's really nothing here. What about the employee area though? Is there anything in the employee area? Look, it's that assistant girl. Hey! I knew it, she was here. Hi, WP's lawyers, right? I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. Oh, <laughs> don't mention it. <laughs> why, why did I do that? Is it true that they caught the security lady? Oh, oh, <laughs> actually, she just called me. She told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? Yeah. Wow, what a mess. I... I know. I'm not so good with handiwork. Some assistant, right? Yeah, but you do work on the props and the backdrops, right? Right. J 
Just lots of times they end up looking worse than they did before I fixed them. Oh, oh, well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing, nothing to worry yourself about. You're right, I won't. Personally, I think she should worry at least a little bit more. Um, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the guard station. I'm supposed to fill in for Miss Oldbag. Right, see you later then. Good luck with your investigation. Ooh, okay, so she is working for the... She is working technically for that. So the fanboy they were talking about in the trial today, he came in through that drain? So it seems. I guess I covered it up in a hurry. Hey! Hey, Nick! If that drain's covered, then the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah, I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though. Don't you? What? You want to rip the grade off? Really, Nick? We can? Whoa, she's serious? Uh-oh. Uh, do we just plunge? Nah. Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. Yay! You know, Nick, you're pretty swell sometimes. Yeah, pretty swell indeed. Sometimes. And there she goes with the little flash on the screen. <sighs> there we go. The things we do. The things we do for love. The things we do. The drain grid is off, and I know who did it. Now the kids will be able to come in again. Doesn't make you great to do a good deed like that. Must be nice to live so free of guilt. If this comes back to bite, to bite us in the butt one more time, I swear, dude. I swear. It makes it a lot easier to go uphill. Yeah. Uh, okay, what about the stakes? Again, I have the urge. I have the urge to, well, examine pretty much ev absolutely everything because I just do. Uh, yeah, no, I, I, I highly doubt that this would be a... Yeah. Um, is there anything else in the dressing room? This is where the steel samurai costume was on the day of the murder. That's what Mr. Power says, at least. I guess he snuck in and took it while he was sleeping. But Nick, what if Mr. Powers hadn't been sleeping? I wonder the killer I wonder what the killer was planning on doing then. Huh. She's got a point. I mean, technically, yeah. Yeah. I mean I guess I guess like Maybe he's just like a heavy sleeper, that's all. And I'm just leading and I'm just leading to assume that there's like there's, you know, nothing else to do. These snacks, they've been past they passed the expiration date. Then don't eat them. Oh, they're snacks. They're meant to be eaten. You're right. Supermarket tabloids? Wow, I'm kinda shocked. My, I'll leave those alone! Wolfman found on Mars. I'll have to buy that issue. <laughs> That's great. That's great, dude. You, you like... You like the dude. Samurai Boogie Woogie, Mick. Get with the picture! Look, explain to me how you can identify the show by seeing a wig. Um, I kind of like samurai movies. Kind of, yeah. You kind of do. You kind of do... You kind of do be liking those samurai movies, buddy. You really do. Okay. Nothing else to report there. Nothing else to do. Oh, hello. Oh, why does everyone keep saying that? You look a little out of place. It's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camel vest might do the trick. Kind of an altern alternative guard fashion thing. All right then. Now finally some progress. Uh, let's uh, talk about the studios. So how are the studios doing? There are police wandering around everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. Don't want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned up our lunch plates on the day of the murder. You mean those plates with the steak bones left over and on them on the employee area? Yeah, can you believe it? I mean, first of all, that's actually kind of gross. Secondly, yeah, you probably want to do that for, for our crime scene. 
Do kids sneak in here a lot? Well, I don't think there's that many of them, but I do see one in particular, a bunch. He's always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old windbag's eyes flash when, you, when she sees him. She has a bit of a trouble catching him, though. The director, Ital. I heard something about... I heard something at the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here on the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here, though. The studio head seemed pretty eager to keep us quiet. So they were trying to protect the director. More the producer, really. The producer's our real star here. She saved, the, she saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in business if they weren't for that producer. The producer, huh? Yeah, what about the producer then? Hmm? Hmm? Hey. <laughs> okay. Uh, what about... Okay. I'm, I'm kind of thinking that maybe we should go outside Studio 2 then. Yeah. This place is deserted. Oh! N Nick! What was that noise? Uh-oh. Trouble. It sounded like it came from the trailer. Someone must be inside. H hello? No answer. Pretty suspicious if you ask me, Nick. Let's go in. I'm not sure we should be barging in. Huh. It's locked. What? Don't we have a key? No, but there's probably one in the guard station at the main gate. Then what are we waiting for? Let's borrow it. If they'll let us. Yeah, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, go ahead and d d do that thing. Do that thingy, my bob. Uh, oh, uh, wait. Here we go. The security guard station. I can see the computer there. Oh, please don't touch anything in there. The security lady would knock the stuffing out of me if she knew. I really want the key to that trailer. Maybe next time. So what, we can't? We can't actually do that? We can't talk to her about anything else either. Highly doubt we'll be able to present her with anything. Alright, yeah. Actually, no, because this is actually additional sh stuff, you know. Oh, Mr. Wright, thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky to tell the truth. You can say that again. Let's not. So, WP... Do you have any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Hmm. Sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no matter how small. You can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Y yes. Okay. Do our fanboys sneak into the studios often? N not, no, not that I know of. That security lady's pretty strict with them. But in today's testimony, didn't she say they were off they were often hanging around? The kids really, really love to steal samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Was the director present at the morning run through? Yes, yes he was. He was directing how the steel samurai and how the evil magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us that before? Well, just the studio asked us to keep it quiet. That has nothing to do with this. I hate to repeat myself, but Nick here is a newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. When he loses, he's going to lose big. I... I see. Whose side is she on? Not ours, apparently. You aren't hiding anything from us, are you? No, I sure hope not. This guy, the real hero, it monitors the room, and of course we have smile for the camera, take a selfie with Mr. WP here. I can't really think of anything else, literally, at the freaking 
at the freaking moment other than to possibly go back to the place. Go back to the place where the thing is, so I guess we can just... Uh, no. The trailer door, it's locked. The key is probably in the thing. I doubt they'll let us borrow it. WTF? Who are you dudes? Lamal? What? What? Was this game actually ahead of their time? In, like, internet speak? I just randomly decided to go back to the re to the dressing room, I guess, just trying to see if there's anything we could do there, but, like, wow, look at this thing. What are you? Huh? We... Wait, you first. Who are you? You look pretty suspicious to me. Whatever, lamers. How can you not know the great sound Manella? I make to lead shows. The Steel Samurai Mine. Read the film credits. R really? You're the Sal... M Sal... Salmonella. We'll just call it like Salmonella. Let's 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 be real. I I'm so sorry. I just... You look so... Sorry. No, no. Quite all right. Really. It's fine. Raffle. Look at this dude. Look at this dude. <laughs> look at him. <sighs> Wow! <laughs> what is it? You know, on closer inspection... Um, oh god! Oh my god! What? Hello? Hello? Uh, no. I'm not reading that. Hey, do you do a lot of, do you do a lot of cosplay? Because that costume rocks us, Jewel. R rock source? What, what, what? Hey, you're drooling! Huh? Mm, lol. Buffer overrun. Pant. You triggered my creative power! <laughs> yes, yes, it's coming to me! Pink Princess! Yo! The sequel to the Steel Samurai. Pink Princess, Warrior of Little old Tokyo! Yo, I want that to be a thing now. Raffle Lamau! Pink princess? Why is it gotta be Little Old Tokyo? Why can't I have a cool name like Neo Old Tokyo? Maya, we really need to talk about cool. I don't understand this man at all, and I would be better not to understand him. Let's talk about the day of the crime. Ugh, did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, you know how you dudes are. That security lady told you about us, eh? That's right. It was a pretty regular day. We've had a run through of the action scene in the morning. Then a meeting from lunchtime in the Studio 2 trailer. <laughs> I was just so busy and I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch, frowny face. A T-bone steak, was it? Yeah, suck sores. I miss it. I miss... Oh, God, your tongue, dude. Your tongue, please. I hate missing out on food. Nick, what does suck sores mean? No idea. I don't understand you nerd speak. Anyway, I was in a meeting from noon till four. With the producer and some bigwigs from the network. Mr. Hammer's time of death was estimated at 2.30 p.m. If he's telling the truth, that meeting gives him an alibi. About the producer who was at the meeting with you. Oh, you mean D. Vasquez? She's a genius. Mad skills all the way. Scary, though, sweats. She was burying those studios from back from the brink of destruction. She was the one who made it possible for me to make the Steel Samurai. You had a meeting with her on the day of the murder, right? Yeah, we were together from noon until four, the whole time. Who exactly are these bigwigs people keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over at the network and some sponsors, and a few production guys. They piled into a limousine and got here around noon. Major tension! Sweats. Were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. 
They're all gray-haired geezers, scowl. Hmm. It sounds like they'd all be reliable witnesses. Definitely, definitely. There's definitely nothing more to examine there unless that's a bunch of snacks. Hey, hey Nick! What now? The the snacks. There's twice as much uh, there was twice as much here before. Uh yeah, I uh, I eat them. They were past their expiration date anyway, Raffle. Bro. She's biting her lip and staring at me with tears welling up in her eyes. I mean, that's definitely Maya, dude. That is definitely Maya. Uh, well. well damn, man. That guy just, just enhanced some things. Wow, okay. So do you think now we, oh God. Oh, hello, hello, hi, hi, you're out now. Aha! You again! Eek! How rude, acting like you've seen a ghost. Well, to be fair, you are one, dude. You certainly got to back to your post quickly. Oh, the police took me away, they did. They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on, can you imagine? How could I, a sweet old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway, know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. Sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now! One, two, three! Mm. This lady's too much. 